Here's the moment we've been waiting for all hour. We've been tracking Robert Frank's trip to the Hamptons. It's a tough job, but somebody has to do it. He is just landing at the Hamptons, something like 38 minutes after he took off. Robert. Yeah, Becky, it's, it's around 42 minutes right after we took off in Manhattan. We are touching down right now in East Hampton. Now today, we're looking at the traffic. This will be a trip that by car is gonna be some and a half to four hours, probably closer to four, by fourth weekend traffic. And we're here. And you can see why this is just, you know, for some people worth the expense. But we're gonna to talk today about the noise, the controversy, the crowds, the lights, and the booming business of ride sharing in the sky has brought not just to East Hampton, but to communities. Palm Springs, California, Martha's Vineyard, Nantucket. The whole business of choppering to high-end resorts, why it's caused a bit of controversy in the towns in which they're located. Hampton Airport and kind of the epicenter of the front lines of the helicopter wars in the Hamptons. So all that's coming at you today, but a beautiful day to land here. And we saved at least two and a half, probably three hours by coming by chopper rather than car. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.